Hello, and welcome back to the Elsewhere SMP. Today we're gonna have a pretty quick episode, but an exciting one. And the reason why is we just updated to 1.19. So the Elsewhere server is now uh, updated fully, and we have the mangrove forests, we have the deep dark, we have all of that exciting stuff. And today we're going to go and explore some of it, namely the mangrove swamp thing, because we need some of that wood. I want to build a town hall that shows all of the players that play on the server, and I think one of the blocks I want to use is that new mangrove wood, just to try it out and see how the red goes with everything. I already know much, like quite a bit about this update because I run the server and have to know about updates, but you know, we're gonna go ahead and check it out and bring some of that wood over here. And I'm gonna see if Nin wants to come with me because he's online right now, so uh, let's see if Nin is free and if he wants to come. Let's go! Alright, so, yeah, do you want to come on an adventure with me? I'm good with that. Alright, cool. We're going to go and see the new mangrove swamp. Oh, I haven't actually... Hold on, I need buckets. Okay, I also haven't seen it. I also need buckets. Um, I... I want fog. Yeah. I am genuinely in love with the fog. I they also are the want cutest the frogs. Okay. I'm not going for the frogs, but I do also want the frogs. I only care about the frogs. Yeah, What's right. an excessive number of buckets to bring? I'm gonna. They only. There's only one kind of frog in the swamp, right? Yes. And then you have to bring them to other places. You bring the, the like little bits, the the eggs. The right? little frog bits. Yeah. yeah. Do you have? Are we going in the Nether or Overworld? Uh, we're gonna go in the Overworld. There's a new teleport pad that Ooh. appeared down at the spawn area like you know the spawn teleportation pad yeah um yeah I, there's a new one that that showed up and it says the wilds so i and oh. it has an exclamation point so i'm assuming that it's gonna get us there i i trust in the teleportation yeah i mean it hasn't led me astray before actually it's led it me astray been, before like two or three times yeah honestly. i was gonna say it actually has a couple of times but i it probably won't this time so all right, I believe I'm ready. Hell yeah. All right, let's go. Let's go find some frogs. All right, I'm ready. Bonk. Oh, jeez. Bonk. Oh. I guess it did lead you astray. Oh, it did. We're going to do a adventure part two, electric boogaloo. Let's, let's, hop in, <laughs> let's hop down here. All right. So yeah, we're going to do part two of this. <laughs> Try again now with added friend. And hopefully we... Oh, no. <laughs> I miss added friend. <laughs> Alright. Adventure part two. Click the button Ooh. at the end. Straight into the middle of a swamp. This time. Uh, um, that's not where I went. Uh, did you click the button at the very end? I thought I did, but I think I did not. Oh no. <laughs> Was it one that had a sign above it? Yes. What did it say? Uh, I don't remember, but it brought me to the nether. <laughs> oh, it brought you to the nether? It brought me to some place with soul sand. Uh, that's not the nether. I guess welcome to Kaladidas, try not to die. We are now in the swamp. Yeah, how do we get back? I forgot to bring That's a slime. good question. <laughs> I don't know. I have my ender chest, which does have a dimensional directory in it, so we can use that if we have to, worst case scenario. Oh, look at the frog. I want more frog. Oh wait, I can't put him in a bucket, can I? Look at it. Oh, it's so adorable. Alright, first things first, I'm gonna take a propagule. Extremely. Huh? And you just, uh, you're a slime, so maybe not friendly to you. Oh. Lucky. They eat slimes. The worst nightmare of soul. Frogs. Justice for slimes. We could, we could breed them. I have slime. And also, soul's made of slime. So, I'm just gonna decimate part of this swamp and just take all the mud. Oh, this is kind of cool, actually. I like walking under the like mangrove trees, like through their roots and stuff. I Looks found like a can... frog next to a frog. All right, where? so you can. You... I am back where you are mining mud. Getting down to the froggy business. Oop. Okay, so you can you left take frog this? Spawn? I don't think so. I think we have to wait. Are you sure? I thought you could take it with silk oh. touch. Oh, did you just break it? You killed what babies. What did I do? I killed... Don't look at me like that, buddy. You just murdered you... their children. You know, it's kind of weird that you can put an axolotl in a bucket, but you can't put a frog in a bucket. Like, they're the... Yeah, Frogs are, like, it smaller. It makes me sad. Because they'll hop out. 
<laughs> you know, that's valid. I have given them the slime. I think they are off to make the... <laughs> so sorry oh, no. for laughing. That's one way to get back. That is one way to get back. Um, here. Where did you die? How did you even do that? I'm right, right next to you. I landed right, right next to you. Right next to you. Oh, really? I didn't even see yeah. it. Yeah. Um... I, but I landed one meter away from the water. <laughs> oh, the new- I don't know if you, either of you have music on, but the new music as well is really good. I- oh, oh, <laughs> Where did you come from? Did you jump out of here? Oh, they all jumped out. Oh my gosh, yeah, I told so you that they, high. It's a frog, what do you expect? I expected it to be able to jump, like, four blocks. A horse can jump four blocks. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh my gosh! That frog just freaked out. I don't think that's intended. All right, I have three frogs. What are the chances any oh. of them make? It? Oh, wait! One of the things is gone. Where are the tadpoles? Oh, oh, frogs! Oh, there's one. Frogs. Aha! <laughs> bucket, bucket. All right, lads. I say, um, I've got two tadpoles. A bunch of mud and enough propagules to uh, make my way back. So I think I'm gonna send myself back. Um, Nin. Good. I'm. Good luck. I'm waiting on some frogs to hatch. Good luck in the wild. It was an honor. I'm a. Ne my next task is to go to the deep dark. What we're gonna do is right behind me in this big open space. Uh, if you've seen this area before, it was not like this. I just did a ton of terraforming. So this area used to have a village in it, lots of trees, and was very jagged. I've taken all that out, cleared it out, and torched it up, and am now going to build something right behind our giant TV screen over here. But to do that, I'm going to need a lot of mangrove logs, which, if you haven't seen my video about my easy mangrove farm, go check it out up in the sort of card thing up there, right? Yep, you see it. Uh, and then we'll go ahead and build it on here. Oh, there's Sunset's Dawn right behind me going to his new storage system. But yeah, so we need a bunch of mangrove logs, and I now have a bunch uh, due to this, which is our mangrove farm. And if you haven't seen it, then definitely go check out that video, but uh, I'll give you a quick rundown. Basically, we grow a mangrove tree up there in this sort of like water collection platform. Here's all the redstone back here. It's kind of crammed in. And then... Uh, some TNT drops at certain timings and certain heights and it explodes the mangrove tree from the bottom up. It doesn't destroy the whole tree, but it destroys the bottom half of the tree. And then we collect all that. And that's how we've been getting our mangrove logs and roots. So now let's go see all the stuff that I have collected for this build. Okay, so here's our little setup. We have just some stone and stuff like that, and campfires. We'll, we'll get into what we're building here in a second. but. Uh, then we have all our mangrove logs. This is from running that machine probably, I don't know, like a few times, maybe 30 minutes or so. And then uh, we have some spruce and some other things. We've got our roots. Uh, that machine's actually really good at getting roots and better than getting logs than, wait, better at getting roots than logs. Anyways, you get the idea. Uh, and then in here, we have a ton of hay bales, which you can't actually see it, but in another project over that way, I uh, have a little, you know, auto wheat farm thing that I've been just gathering wheat for this build. So uh, without further ado, I think it's time we get into a time lapse. Let's go. Let's take one last look at this thing uh, inside and out, and then I'll do all the detail work and like ground stuff and make it look pretty uh, before our next episode. So we'll come we'll come take a look at this next episode just a little bit too. Uh, so let's go. And to show off this new building, I thought it would be nice to turn on shaders, which I haven't used in a long time. But here it is, the entrance to the great hall of players. We enter here. We've got some nice lighting, we've got campfires, and then you see all of the players that play on the Elsewhere server. We don't have everyone's heads yet, but I'm hoping to get them soon. I think we're going to have an event to try to do that. But we do have my head, Cuzza's head, Draco's head, uh, let's see, Sunset's head, 
Ah, he's come for the killing. Perfect. Easy. Nin and Antonio Brown. And also the Untitled. So we have quite a few of them. Um, I'm going to be doing a lot more sort of decorating and detail work all throughout the inside of this, as well as the outside of this build. So here it is on the outside from the side view, which will probably have a path coming out here leading over to more stuff, because I've just terraformed this area for more people to build. But yeah, I hope you guys like this build. I hope you guys enjoy the style as well as time lapses and everything. Let me know what you thought of this video. And until next time, I hope you all have a really nice day. Bye.